Hi, it's Carly McAvoy. I wanted to do a quick video to show you how to set up GeoGebra so you can use the spreadsheet function. When I go to geogebra.org and then click on GeoGebra Classic, this is what I get. Now I've used this program several times, so the spreadsheet function is right here for me, and if I click on spreadsheet, it's ready to go. If you don't want this graph over here, click on the, the little triangle circle thing and on the three dots, click on close. That will close that out. Now you're ready to put data into your spreadsheet and work from there. If you click on GeoGebra Classic and you don't get this, let's say you just get this grid and this doesn't look like a spreadsheet and you're like, nothing looks like what she said it should look like. Click on again, this little circle up here at the top and the drop down menu and you'll see spreadsheet there. Now, if you click on spreadsheet, now it's over here to the right. That's not where you want it. Plus you have this grid here. Go ahead and click on these dots and close this. And then you can click on this, these dots and close that. And this puts you back in that spreadsheet mode. You're ready to put your, your data here. Once you put data in there, um, whoops. Whatever your data is, then highlight it. Make sure it's gray when you highlight it. Click on this up here and that will give you a chance to make a histogram that will show up right over here, which is what you need to do. From here you can do the drop down to do a box plot and you can see that information as a box plot. Or if you want to see the data that we're talking about, like mean, uh, standard deviation and all that, you click on this button right here. So that's how you can get started and I hope this works for you. Have a great day.